the No Fate channel, checking in. On today's episode of Dad's Home Gym, I am reviewing the Chic Weightlifting Belt Model 2006, and as a bonus, I'm gonna review their weightlifting straps. <laughs> On this Dad's Home Gym series, I review a piece of gym equipment or gym accessories on every episode to help you decide if it's something that you want to add to your home gym or just add it to your weightlifting regimen. Today from Chic.com, I have their weightlifting belt model 2006. Um, they saw my dad's bad back series and I am personally recovering from a back injury and they asked if I would be interested in reviewing their weightlifting belt. Of course I said yes. What they didn't realize is that I have been um, a longtime user of Chic products since way back in college, okay? And I'm a, I don't even wanna tell you how long that's been, but I've been using their products since way back in college. They have been a manufacturer of gym accessories, gloves, wraps, belts for quite some time. And they've been in business for a while because they do it right. I think like 99% of their products are absolutely made in America. Their headquarters is located in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Now, I don't know about you, but I've vacationed in Wisconsin twice. I love it there. It's absolute God's country. I mean, it's the epitome of made in America. One of the other things that they do really well is that they have amazing customer service. They are not hard to find, whether it's through email or phone call. Um, and before I even get into this belt, one of the things that's an absolute standout, okay, not only is it they got the made in America on both locations, right? They're really proud about being made in America, and I don't blame them, but they put their phone number right here on the belt, okay? They're not afraid of you calling them, okay? They're not afraid of being found. Some companies, they offer a warranty and then you can't, you can't actually get to them. Not, not chic.com. They have great customer service um, and there's a reason they've been in business for quite some time. A few of the standouts with regards to this Chic belt is the fact that it has a nice wide back. It has six inches top to bottom in that middle of the back span. And one thing that the photos I took of it didn't kind of pick out, but um, once you have it in your hand, you notice is that it is actually tapered. So um, if I open it up, hopefully you can get a better idea of, you can see that it is actually tapered from the back around the hips, okay? So this would be the hip section that it's tapered. And what that allows is that when you're wearing it, um, you get that nice tough support in the back, which is what you want. You don't want, you don't, you don't want to, go, you don't want to hit Snap City like I did a couple, week, couple weeks ago. Um, but what happens is if you've got those big bulky belts, they're really uncomfortable on the hips, they're uncomfortable on the waist, and they make it almost impossible to even lift. Even though you want that support in the back, you still want as much mobility as you can. You kind of want your cake and you want to eat it too. So by having that taper around the around the hips, it is you get that support in the back, but you get that, you know, that mobility, that comfort that comes with having a nice belt like this. And I, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier in the video, but it comes with a two-year warranty. And again, chic.com is known for their customer service. Um, in terms of colors, I know you guys, I was able to pick out red. I think it comes in over six colors during the editing. I'll put all the colors up here. It comes in a ton of colors. If you are one of those folks that likes to color coordinate or you have a favorite color. Um, one of the nice things about this belt that differentiates itself from a no number of other, um, you know, nice flexible belts is that it has this Velcro here on the inside strap. So in order to use this belt, you take this Velcro and then you cinch it up here around the waist okay so now you've got it nice and cinched and then to add extra support and to really lock it in you take this velcro you put it through one way and you come back around hopefully the camera can pick this up there's a nice little uh, piece here that allows you to kind of pull and get some leverage and put it around your waist and i will tell you from my use of this for over a week it feels nice when you put it on it feels like you've got some really nice support in the back, but it doesn't feel like you're in like a girdle. You really, you really notice the taper around the sides. So I mentioned it comes in over six colors. Let's talk about cost. Of course, when you get quality, you got to pay for quality. It comes in at $55 at chic.com, and I believe they sell it on amazon.com for around that price. Uh, full disclosure, I got this for free, but I don't have any coupon codes. I don't know if there are out there. So if you are interested in purchasing this, I would say definitely Google coupon codes for chic.com. Um, so $55, what does it get you? It gets you a great belt at, uh, with a two year warranty. And for the sake of your back, um, I would definitely say spend the money. Now, when we do say spend the money, it's like, how long is it gonna last? Because of course, 
If you spend $55 and it only lasts a few months, that's obviously a waste of your money. But something like this is probably going to last you five to six years, depending on your use. Why do I say five to six years? It's not going to last a lifetime. Uh, almost nothing lasts a lifetime, obviously. The thing that is going to fail on this, at least from my perspective, is going to be the Velcro. And that often is what happens to fail on stuff like this because, you know, the repetition of putting it on, taking it off, putting it on, taking it off. So obviously the more you use it, the more um, repetitions you get on it, it's going to eventually wear that Velcro down. But I will say again, you're going to get five or six years and at that $55 price tag, definitely, definitely worth it. Um, a few things I do want to mention in terms of washing it feels like you could throw this in a washing machine. Do not. You would not only are you going to ruin the fabric, you're going to break down the um, Velcro even quicker. And you want this to last as long as you, you can get out of it. Uh, so hand wash it, all right? So spray it with like a light detergent, hand wash it, air dry it. Um, overall, I've been extremely happy with this. And normally when I see those price tags of like $55, I think, is it worth it? 100% worth it. Let's talk about sizing in terms of which size is going to be right for you. I'll put the size chart up here. Chic.com, you can find the size chart. Keep in mind, when you take your size measurement around your waist, take it around your belly button. That's a big, that's a big must have. Take it around your belly button. Also, the sizes that they have come in a range, right? So there's a size, but that size fits a certain range. I would say if you were on the lower end of that range, right? If you're on the bottom end, go to the smaller size. It's going to be easier to get it tighter and it's going to just be a little bit more comfortable when you're trying to cinch it up and whatnot. So again, if you're on that lower end of the range, go to the smaller size. You're going to be glad you did. Let's talk about their wrist strap. So I have two versions that I've used here over the oh, in the past um, and they're really nice. So chic.com was one of the first, if not the first, I don't, I don't know, I don't know my, you know, wrist wrap history to actually come out with a nice Velcro wrist support for your wrap. The old school wraps that would go around your wrist um, and you'd wrap around the bar. You probably know what I'm talking about. I'll put a picture right here. Um, they really dug into your wrist, especially as the weight got uh, heavy. They really, really dug into your wrist. And oftentimes after the set, you, you know, you'd see those marks. Let's quickly talk about the similarities and differences between the dowel system that I have here on my right hand and the weightlifting straps that I have here on my left hand. So in terms of similarities, they both have this nice Velcro closure with the foam padding on your wrist, making uh, not only it comfortable on your wrist, but adding an extra layer of wrist support when you're doing whatever lift you are doing. Uh, in terms of the main differences, obviously it's in the length of the wrap. This dowel system is meant to go on and off very quickly, just to give you a little bit of extra grip and to take a little bit of emphasis off your forearms and hopefully put it on the muscle where it belongs. And this is more uh, synonymous with your standard lifting strap, your old school lifting strap. You're gonna go around the bar maybe two and a half times, cinch it tight. And what the difference is, this is gonna be quick on, quick off, and this is gonna take a few extra seconds every time. Also, my personal experience, you tend to get more support, more stability with this wrap only because um, you're going around a few times. Now I've talked to multiple people that have used each and I'll tell you right now, it tends to be like 50-50. Some people love this dowel style and some people love this wrist wrap style. Let's talk about color and cost. As you can see, they come in multiple colors at the time of this filming. I think they both come in six different colors, but uh, during editing, I'll put them up, all the colors that I can find up here on the right-hand side. Um, so you at least know if you are interested in getting a color other than black, it's available. In terms of price, they are both the same price, um, $25, which is really, really good considering the quality of the build. In terms of how long they've lasted me in the past, keep in mind, I use these things on almost every set, on almost every day, even leg day, back day. You know, only thing I don't think I use them on is uh, chest day because I'm pushing, right? But I've used them on everything and they tend to last me approximately two years, which is great value for that $25 price tag considering how much I use them. And if you don't use straps nearly as much as me, they're gonna last you that much longer. I have been a longtime fan of Chic.com since college after using their weightlifting straps. And now since I've reviewed their 2006 model weightlifting belt, I'm still a big fan. Not only do they have a great warranty, they create top quality products made in America and they stand by their products. If you're interested in any of their products, Chic.com, Amazon.com, or anywhere that weightlifting accessories are sold, 
Also, if you have any questions regarding these products, drop them in the comments below and I will answer them as quickly as possible. If you came this far in the video, give this video a like, hit that subscribe button, it obviously helps out the channel. As usual, thanks for watching and don't save anything for the trip back. I am dedicated to helping you be a great parent to your children and still accomplish your own personal goals. I provide ideas and insights to help you save time, money, and your sanity. Three things that are in short supply for every parent out there.